So Tim, tell me what you do here at San Antonio Museum of Art. Well, uh, my title is Director of Exhibits, and I just manage the, the building of the exhibits, the installation of the exhibits. I have uh, four remarkable people that work for me that are quite talented, and uh, we get a lot done. We work, we have a building across the street that has a carpenter shop and metalworking and mount booth and making labels, clean room. Uh, we are always complimented by visiting museums because nobody has that much room for construction. So Tim, when you have a new exhibit here at, at uh, San Antonio Museum of Art, what's the process for installation? Well, most of the time I will uh, look to see whether it is a, a flat show, which is just paintings. Those are much easier to install. Or if it's a three-dimensional show, has a lot of objects, which then will require casework and mounts and a lot more time. Uh, after that, we get together with different departments and try to understand everybody's needs for that exhibit, uh, talk to the curators and work on a layout, a design, which hopefully we have before we get the exhibit here. But after we find out what it is, uh, before COVID, I would go to the other museums and look at shows that were available like that. Uh, but now we zoom a lot of things and um, it's always interesting to find out the different requirements that different museums have for the same kind of things. Uh, for the installation? Installation. And what they call them. We, we'll get an exhibit from uh, England and the picture hangers that we use, they call them Ryman clips. Uh, so I had to look up what a Ryman clip was and there's my picture hanger. Uh, <laughs> we use a lot of plexiglass. They call it Perspex. Uh, and the first time I did one of those shows, I had to figure out the uh, vocabulary. <laughs> so how long does it take to install a show? Well, uh, between installations in our changing exhibit gallery, we usually get four, hopefully five weeks uh, between shows. And we'll have done most of the uh, prep and legwork in the shop for cases and things uh, prior to that. But the show will show up. Uh, you have to wait 24 hours before you can open crates so that all the art can acclimate to our climate in the museum. And we usually get the curator there and we have a layout figured out and we start usually section by section. And if it's a painting show, we'll find those crates, take those paintings out, set them around the room on, uh, on pads. And then the curator will judge everything the way they, the way they see it. And that's how we do it uh, for that. Usually about three days of the curator being here will let us decide where everything goes. And then if it's a painting show, uh, we can hang paintings fast. Uh, I did a Cowden show several years ago that was just photographs. They were all eight by 10 and I hung 99 in one day. That's my record. Yeah. So uh, uh, wow. I would have done a hundred, but the frame was broken on that one. Uh, three dimensional work though, that's a different ball game. We'll have a, uh, a mock-up session with the curator where we mock up the height of the pedestal. We have a cart that will pump up and down. Uh, we'll mock up the size that we think the, uh, the the top deck on the case should be, arrange the art, figure out how high little uh, blocks or risers should be, and make notes of all of that. And hopefully we know the angle the art's gonna be at. And from all of that information, um, my carpenter can go and start working on the casework and building the blocks and uh, helpers can sand and paint. Uh, I will look at the objects and try to figure out what kind of mount it needs or if it needs a mount. And then we fabricate those. And when installation day comes, we have all the casework there, hopefully ready to set the art in place and close the lid. Uh, it doesn't always work that easily, but uh, there's, there's always issues. But I mean, that's kind of what I see my job as is figuring out the issues. Right. I have guys that do the work as prescribed and there's always a ton of issues 
Uh, so we we make it work. <laughs>